to the Supreme Court set to hear what could be a landmark case involving freedom of religion. Our senior national correspondent Terry Moran is at the Supreme Court with more. Good morning to you, Terry. Good morning, Rebecca. This is a huge case. Uh, yet another battle in the ongoing war over religious freedom and separation of church and state. And it could have major implications for nearly every American workplace and American worker. Gerald Groff is an evangelical Christian missionary who worked part time at the Postal Service, delivering mail every day except Sundays until 2013, when the Postal Service contracted with Amazon to start delivering Sundays. Groff told his bosses he couldn't work Sundays because of his faith, said he'd work holidays and double shifts, but his bosses insisted, and so he resigned. Federal civil rights law protects Americans against discrimination in the workplace on the basis of their religious faith unless accommodating an employee's faith would put, quote, undue hardship on the business. Decades ago, Supreme Court defined undue hardship to mean anything more than a de minimis cost, a trivial cost. And religious freedom advocates say that's led to discriminating against people of faith. Gerald Groff says that's unfair, but employers warn that they could end up accommodating everything from workers at pharmacies who don't want to dispense birth control to workers who won't get vaccinated. It is a major case, and we expect a decision by June. Many uh, will be watching, Terry, as you know. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.